Retirement is by no means dead, but it is being displaced as the central institution in the second half of life, and it's being displaced by work, by longer working lives, by a new phase of work in the lives of millions of aging boomers who neither have the desire to go off to the sidelines nor, in many cases, the financial ability to stop working altogether. Boomers who are launching Encore careers are at the intersection of two of the biggest trends of our time, much longer working lives and the desire, the recognition, the realization that we need to change the world. If the old dream, the one that worked for 50 years, could be characterized as the freedom from work, the liberation from labor, the New Deal that's emerging could be called the freedom to work on new terms, in new ways, to new and an often more important ends. Many people are poised to launch an encore career at the intersection of continued income, new meaning, and the opportunity to make some of their most significant contributions to use their experience in ways that matter not only to employers and to themselves, but to the society. The movement of tens of millions of boomers into a new phase in their working lives is the biggest transformation in the American workforce since millions of women a generation ago broke down barriers and moved into roles that were off limits to their mother's generation. For the most part, this group has been all dressed up with few places to go. We've discounted their experience. We've made it difficult to find work that's personally meaningful and that makes a significant contribution to the well-being of the country and we're missing what might well be one of the big opportunities of the 21st century. To capture this windfall of time, talent, and experience, we're gonna to need to be every bit as creative as we were in the last century when we tried to convince people to leave the workplace. We're gonna to need to be as bold as we were when we developed social security, as innovative as we were when we created retirement communities and senior centers and other new kinds of social institutions. And we're gonna to need to come up with a, a vision of work in this new century that will not only prod people to work a little bit longer, but will inspire people to, put, to develop a, an entirely new phase of their working lives, an encore career that benefits not only individuals in terms of financial reward and in terms of using their experience, but also amounts to a windfall for communities.